Assalamu alaikum everyone, welcome to the Safi Bros podcast. It's been a long time waiting, alhamdulillah, we just finished uh, building this amazing studio. Uh, inshallah to project some amazing stories for you brothers and from our own brothers and sisters to share. Uh, alhamdulillah, it's been a what, couple of years worth of work to get this room ready. And uh, we're now ready, inshallah, to start recording. This will be our first sort of discussion episode about sure. what we're doing and how we're doing it. And uh, the idea behind the Safi Bros podcast and what we do. I'll first, I'll get Brahim, inshallah, to introduce himself. Salam, uh, Brahim Safi. Um, obviously, some of you might know us from Burgies and uh, from our events catering arm that we own. Um, alhamdulillah, we also founders of VNAF, uh, married with four boys. Alhamdulillah. So Ahmed Safi, um, <coughs> also yeah, partners in business. Me and Brahim do everything together, alhamdulillah, in everything we do. Uh, you know, Burgies, My Pie, Fiesta Events. Uh, we've been doing that for about over 25 years in business, alhamdulillah. And uh, one thing we've done amazingly as brothers is built an amazing uh, network of Muslim brothers and sisters within the community. And we founded the uh, Network Australia Foundation mm. together with a lot of good brothers and sisters that we do leadership training and leadership retreats with. And amazing networking for our Muslim brothers and sisters. And uh, inshallah, many of the brothers and sisters that have been so supportive of what we've done through NAF and through other businesses that we've done, we're going to have them on board here discussing some beautiful, amazing, um, what we call success stories. stories. So success stories, inshallah, will be uh, our pathway through this podcast room. It'll be our first series to we'll be having discussions with uh, brothers and sisters in the Muslim community that uh, have achieved success in many different ways. And as we know, success means so many different things to so many different people. But I think what we're going to be bringing is a perspective on what is success, an Islamic perspective. And also we're going to be bringing uh, a perspective on success through failure and uh, what does it mean to really succeed through failure. And also how do we tie that all in to an Islamic identity, inshallah. Um, we will be also having some uh, discussion sessions on different topics throughout the time. We're starting with about uh, eight interviews with different brothers and sisters that are all lined up and uh, we're all excited about getting these out to you guys. Um, SubhanAllah, it's, uh, me and Brahim have got so many different amazing stories, you know. Mm. And uh, Brahim Hala will share like a one little story with you guys. That, you know, we have a daily story. Yeah, on the topic of success, alhamdulillah, I think we'll start with that. Um, SubhanAllah, uh, a young Muslim came to our business uh, wanting to take over our marketing and social media. So I, I had a quick chat with him in the boardroom and seemed like a young, you know, ambitious Muslim, uh, you know. So I said to Ahmed, look, I think you should meet him. He seems, uh, seems hungry. Um, Anyway, I had a, had a about ten minute conversation with him. I think at the time, yeah. uh, you know, mentoring session, and he really liked what I had to say. And then Ahmed also had a fifteen minute chat with him. Anyway, and alhamdulillah, he ended up in our office on the couch, and uh, he said to to me, he goes, "Mashallah, you're very successful." And I started laughing, and he took offence to my uh, laughter, obviously, and uh, he goes. What makes you laugh at what I said? I said, what is success to you? And he said, mashallah, you know, you know, you and your brother working together. And at that time, a, a couple of my staff members walked in and he's seen the love between us. And uh, he also, you know, he goes, mashallah, he goes, you've made money, obviously. He goes, and, you know, you've got good people around you. And then I also started laughing again. And then he started, he really got upset now because, you know, I've obviously offended him twice by... Uh, by laughing at his comments. So he immediately went into defense mode and said, what is success to you then? And, you know, subhanAllah, I said to him, I said to him, this is my personal belief of success. Uh, I said to him, I'm 45 now. And, uh, you know, success has been m multiple things in my life. But I said, true success is contentment. I think uh, a lot of people don't speak about this topic, but True success is contentment. And he said to me, what do you mean by that? I said, what I mean by that is that 
if you if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is predestined for you a million dollars or ten million, and that's your test or your burden, uh, I said if you're really content from your heart, then everything is easy. And and that also applies to all aspects of your life. You know, some 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 families that I know they're not not happy with only one child or two or three or four. You know, being content with what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives you is true success. Yeah, That's ways. that for me. And he he started tearing up and crying and I'm like, I'm not trying to take you there, but I was just trying to awaken him because unfortunately in today's time and, and obviously social media True success is, is all materialistic, so uh, you know, influence and all these uh, jazzes. But, you know, I, our beloved, as we're all well aware, he was offered all those dunya elements on the, on his last uh, breath and he, he refused all of them, obviously, and, uh, and he showed us the true path. So, Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. so I thought I'd share that. I think that, that true contentment is, is, is the true success in my eyes. Inshallah, so we'll be sharing a lot of these stories, uh, not only from ourselves, but from other brothers and sisters who also have gone through their journey, you know, from being doctors, from being lawyers, being so many different kind of, and inshallah, helping our brothers and sisters within the Muslim community, especially our young chaps out there who sometimes feel lost in, you know, how do I, how do I find this, you know, how can you do it? And inshallah, just showcasing that success in so many different ways is so achievable for all of us, you know, as long as we understand these little formulas and uh, put our heads down, inshallah, we will all attain success, whatever it means to us. Mm-hmm. Uh, alhamdulillah. A um, couple of little things, subhanAllah, me and Ibo also like, uh, you know, we, we this I, this comes as an idea, if you remember, yeah. Ibo, remember we sat down and we started going, That's look, right. you know, look, we, doing, we do retreats, alhamdulillah, we get through to about, what, 20, 30, 100 people a year on average, you know. Mm. But there That's we, right. You know. We wanted to get through to some more and uh, yeah. inshallah, spread spread the love, spread the benefit. And uh, our mission statement, believe it or not, is that uh, the best of us are the ones that are most beneficial. And the aim for us is to be of benefit uh, through this podcast, uh, to be of benefit for the Muslim community nationally, internationally. Inshallah. Uh, and uh, as the Rasul um, he was uh, he came down to us, as Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala described him, as a warner, as a witness, uh, as a giver of glad tidings and also um, as a illuminating light. As we all know, the, the verse of the Qur'an, Allah describing him. And inshallah, we want to follow in his footsteps and be that through this podcast, inshallah. Yeah, definitely. So, alhamdulillah, it's uh, been a, a long waiting, a lot of exciting uh, moments along the way, getting this place ready, cameras, v- so many things, subhanAllah, in a so podcast, learning curves. Learning curves with, uh, Made a few mistakes, the wrong brackets. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, SubhanAllah, having the sound insulation, getting sound engineers in here and checking the room, making sure everything is alhamdulillah done professionally so we can get the content out uh, as best as we can. I mean, alhamdulillah. So we ask of you, brothers and sisters, to make dua for us. Uh, truly, with dua, there is success. And uh, that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala puts barakah in what we're doing and uh, enlightens us and elevates us to be of benefit. I mean, I mean. Anything you want to add, bro? No, that's that's pretty much it, inshallah. I'm looking forward to, inshallah, more uh, podcasts and, inshallah, more benefit to our ummah, inshallah. May Allah keep us steadfast and keep us on the righteous. Alhamdulillah. Amen, alhamdulillah. Thank you, guys. Look out for the next episode. It's on its way. So our interviews are all lined up. Uh, keep tuned. Don't forget to like and share. Uh, and inshallah, we'll be putting up some links to our uh, podcast channel, YouTube, etc. So we'll see you soon. Inshallah.